You could say it's apropos that hidden behind a garage-like storefront across from a cemetery lies the so-called Demon Baker of Fleet Street. His name is Bill Yosis, a former executive pastry chef who, as he likes to put it, went from the White House to the slaughterhouse. I've always been a pastry chef in New York. Then in 2006, I got a call from the White House, which I thought was a joke, of course. They said, we'd like you to come and do a tasting for the president and first lady. He made a peach cobbler, which went over well with President George W. Bush and the first lady. Hired by the Bushes, he stayed on through the Obama administration. It's an amazing privilege just to be there at all. Both families were couldn't have been nicer. Yosis says President Bush liked all kinds of desserts. But it was President Obama who famously said he liked pie and even bestowed the nickname of the crust master on this proud pastry chef. That's how I got involved in like creating so many pie recipes. There's a lot of guests, so I did make other things, but I made a lot of pies. <laughs> He was on hand when First Lady Michelle Obama launched her Let's Move initiative, encouraged the White House culinary staff to create more healthy meals. In 2014, he made the bittersweet decision to retire from the White House, launching his own kitchen garden laboratory and opening what else but his own pie shop. It wasn't long before the producers of the off-Broadway production of Sweeney Todd came knocking on his pie shop door. The producers of Sweeney Todd came to me and said, well, would you make pies for our show? I thought, what? Is anyone going to buy my pies if I'm making human pies? <laughs> so this is the truffle powder. It gives a, a really wonderful aroma. So now he's gone from serving heads of state to show patrons eight times a week. I saw the original Sweeney in 1979. I'll date myself. 40 years later, it's like uh, be part of this wonderful production. For Yosis, his biggest starstruck moment to date was serving Queen Elizabeth. She had asked to meet us chefs, which usually doesn't happen. You know, with the sash and the crown and amazing.